Hello friends, today I'll discuss about calculation of three phase fault level for a particular substation. So in this figure, substation A and substation B is connected via double circuit line and it is a panther conductor. Okay, the line length is 100 km and substation A fault level is known. The three phase fault level for substation A is 1000 MBA. And in substation B, there are three number of transformer that is 50 MB 132 by 33 KB transformer running under parallel condition. So in this video, I will discuss about how to calculate uh, the three phase fault level that is fault at three phase uh, symmetrical fault at 33 KB bus. Okay. So here the line parameter for panther conductor is known that is R1 that is the positive sequence resistance and the actance is 0.14 ohm per kilometer and 0.401 ohm per kilometer respectively and zero sequence resistance and reactance of the line is 0.354 ohm per kilometer and 1.33 ohm per kilometer and for the transformer each of the transformer has uh, percentage impedance of 12.5 percent so in this video i will discuss about what is the fault level of 33 kb bus where the fault level of far end substation that is substation A is known. So since the substation A fault level is known that is the three phase fault level is 1000 MBA and it is a 132 kV bus, we can calculate the source impedance that is ZS is equal to KV square by MBA. So it is equal to 132 square divided by 1000 since fault level is 1000 MBA. So ZS comes as 17.42. Ohm. Now, uh, since the R1 and X1 is known for the line parameter, we can calculate the positive sequence impedance that is Z1 is equal to root over of R1 square plus X square, X1 square. So it comes as 0.4247 ohm per kilometer. So since the line length is 100 kilometer, we can calculate the line impedance as Z line is equal to z1 into line length that is 0.4247 into 100 which comes as 42.47 ohm since there is double circuit line or two number of line are connected in parallel in between substation a and substation b so since uh, therefore the z line equivalent comes as uh, line impedance divided by 2 that is 42.47 divided by 2 which is comes as 21.235 ohm so at substation B end, the total impedance, uh, that is the line impedance and source impedance comes as, that is ZB is equal to ZS plus Z line equivalent. That is equal to 17.424 plus 21.235, which comes as 38.659 ohm. Now for transformer, for the transformer, uh, three number of transformer running under parallel condition and each have percentage impedance as 12.5 percent. So we can calculate uh, the uh, impedance uh, seen at 33 kb side for each of the transformer that is ZT 33 is equal to kb square by MVA into percentage impedance that is 33 square divided by 50 into 0.125 is equal to 2.7225 ohm that is the impedance with respect to 33 kb side of the transformer so since the three number of transformer are running under parallel condition uh, jt equivalent that is uh, equivalent impedance of the transformer uh, for the three number of transformer is equal to 2.7225 divided by 3 which comes as 0.9075 ohm so Z equivalent at 33 kb bus, which is equal to ZT equivalent, and that is the equivalent impedance of the transformer at 33 kb level plus ZB 33 kb. That is the impedance of the ZB that is uh, at substation B and 132 kb bus, uh, which is referred to the 33 kb side. So this impedance we have to refer or convert to the 33 kb side. So we can convert uh, the ZB at 33 kb by uh, multiplying the turns ratio that is which is equal to 
ZB33 is equal to 38.659, which is the equivalent impedance at 132 bars of substitution B into 33 square divided by 132 square. That is the N2 square by N1 square for the since the transistor is N1 by N2 is equal to 132 by 33. So ZB33 comes as 2.4162 ohm. So ZT33 is equal to that is the equivalent impedance at 33 kV bus is equal to equivalent impedance of the transformer that is 0.9075 plus ZB at 33 kV level which is 2.4162 which is equal to 3.3237 ohm. Fault level can be calculated uh, for 3 phase MB that is the kV square by for uh, impedance, equivalent impedance, kV square is 33 square divided by 3.3237, which comes as 327.64 MVA. Since the fault level at 33 kV bus is known, that is 327.64 MVA, we can calculate the fault current for three phase fault at 33 kV bus, that is IF33 is equal to fault MVA divided by root 3 into bus voltage, that is 33 which comes as 5.73 kilo ampere. So in this method, we can calculate uh, three phase symmetrical fault at 33 kV bus, uh, where the fault level for the far end substitution is known. Here substitution A and fault level is known, that is uh, 1000 MBA. So in between substitution A and B, there exist uh, two line. So in substation B, there exist three number of transformer which are connected in parallel. So fault occur at 33 kV side at uh, bus. Uh, we can calculate by this method fault at 33 kV bus. Okay.